is about to get epic. Hello and welcome back to Griffin Triple Six's Adventures in Minecraft. What do we got to do? Plenty. I need to actually deposit some of this useless crap right now. Oh, I've picked up a, a sizable chunk of uh, watching call it's coal. <laughs> Righty ho! I need to actually build more tools. That's high on the list of things to do. And that would be one, two, three, four. Four's usually pretty good. And a couple more shovels. Whoops. One, two, three, four. Sweet. Okay. Um. Well, that doesn't leave me with a lot of. Okay. Are there any monsters chilling out here? Doesn't look like it. Um, oh, there's a creeper. I'm just gonna go kill the creeper. I'm actively seeking creepers. That seems smart. But hey, it's what I do. <laughs> I can have a sexy cold voice. Ah, creepers kind of bug it off into the, uh, the craziness. Ah, screw it, he can despawn later. I won't chase him. I'll get me some pig. Delicious! Okay, um... Oh, it seems a waste to... It seems like such a waste to kind of not do anything outside in the Minecraft world. At this present point. Um... Though ideally, I mean, I need to actually gather resources. I need to gather cobblestone so I can continue with this structure. So I guess, uh, unfortunately, we're going to be hidden back underground and I'm going to lose track of time. But we. <coughs> God damn it. I have to balance the addiction of Minecraft with the fact that I'm still sick, but I have to make videos if I want to play it. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's arrange this. Meaty meat meat. I probably should put some meat in here. I need to build a bigger box. I'll do that in a bit. But for now, we're gonna keep going down into the depths of Minecraft! Yay! I love how a project in Minecraft kind of just it reinvigorates the game and you just you can't stop playing it. <laughs> so I'm producing videos for a, a much uh, more rapid pace than I would usually do uh, than I would usually produce videos and subsequently it's kind of put Resident Evil 5 on the back burner a little bit though I'm pretty pretty sure that not everyone's going to complain about that. And it's not that I'm abandoning Resident Evil 5, it's more the fact that um, Resident Evil 5 takes a little bit more uh, preparation and editing uh, to produce. Whereas Minecraft, I can just boot up Minecraft, play for half an hour or so, edit the footage, like, back to back, essentially. I don't have to do much to it. I release it and you got to ready-made product and it's great. I need to arrange this in a better way. And it's just a simple project like I'm just gathering resources to uh, build a castle and I just I can't stop thinking about Minecraft. They've uh, notch hit upon a rather fantastic product when he came up with Minecraft. Oh, bollocks. How did that happen? I was pretty sure it was attached to the wall, but... Okay. Alright, now that's actually something that's got to come out. I'm just trying to even it out a bit 
more now since uh, we're heading down into the earth. It's such a relaxing rhythmic thing, actually. When you're just kind of chipping away at the blocks in a, in a just a systematic fashion. It's a nice sound. Okay, so we're going down. Actually, you know, that's... I'm going to clear this part out as well. So uh, that's the trouble with doing these, like, around the side staircases, is I'm not... <laughs> I tend to kind of spiral inwards on myself and not actually realize where I'm going. And uh, the exact dimensions of where I'm actually supposed to be digging. And I'm trying to maximize... the, uh, the cobblestone gathering. So I'm <laughs> probably going to end up doing this for like one whole day and night cycle. Um, yeah, I suppose that warrants a, uh, thing. Okay. So that's the wall. That's actually not. I don't know. <laughs> it's somewhat confusing. I probably should actually, uh, make ladders and then just do this in a more systematic, well, a more, my more traditional technique of building, uh, just a shaft with a ladder down it. I'll see how many, uh, ladder pieces I can, I can produce out of that. Wait, what am I doing? Yeah, no, that's right. Yeah, sticks. I love them. Okay. Let's see what I can do. Unfortunately, this is rather intensive use of sticks. Okay. And those sticks can just get appropriated into that stock of sticks. Okay, so I got 18. So that gives me 36. One. One more. Nah, two more. There we go. That should be sufficient. Okay. Damn it, I just want to be outside. Oh, what a beautiful morning! I should never sing in my videos, ever! Ah! <laughs> okay, uh, alright, what's the best way to do this? Um, that bed might actually need to be moved, and I'd say the best position for doing the ladders is probably here. Wait, no, that's a shovel. This is an axe. Okay. So let's do this. This is gonna suck. I have to come up from the bottom. Hmm. That's gonna be messy. Okay. Whoops. Okay, I'll keep those two parts there. And we'll just dig straight down. I know what's under there. I'm not gonna... Ooh. <laughs> oh my god, I'm an idiot. <laughs> oh my god, I'm dying! Ah. Sorry. <laughs> that was highly stupid of me. <laughs> Famous last words. I know it's okay. Duh. Death. Alright. Oh, Jesus. What am I doing? I'm just slowly killing myself. Okay. Alright. Now I can kind of clear out all these other stairs and things. Um. Yeah. 
Yes. However, I can. However, I can go about this. Just try and clear out the stairs. I'll just do a weird kind of alternating block system, maybe, just so I don't know. Uh, use the dirt. Do this. Just so I have a sort of a guiding rail. Otherwise, I always end up. Oh, that's wrong. Ah, it's so much more difficult doing this. Okay. Oh, crap. Yeah, this is <laughs> this is where I'm very high. Uh, my my likelihood of dying suddenly skyrockets because I start playing around with uh, scaffolding and stuff. I should really be doing this from the bottom up. Dungeon tastic time. Except that, that music doesn't actually uh, doesn't actually indicate a uh, a dungeon, according to the wiki. It's just that uh, it's usually suggesting open space. Oh shit! I left the door open. <laughs> Thank you, ambience, for making me remember to shut the door. Okay, let's let's try this. It's a difficult thing, and I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Shit! What am I doing? This is exactly why you need to put the guide rails in. Now usually I would uh I would allow for a uh oops a specific section. I'm really not clarifying that. And I'm just kinda of trying to concentrate on actually fixing this. Um I would usually mark out the 5x5 five five block where I'm wanting to uh, excavate and then I would go one block back on the side where I wanted to put the ladder and go from there and just go straight down and have a ladder shaft separate from my mine shaft which I haven't done in this case because it's been an afterthought. Probably should have put that one in first. But this way it should be at least uh, a lot safer when I'm coming down. I won't actually fall out of the the ladder shaft causing my premature death. Oh, that's close. I need to eat. Eat some meat. And I'm aware. Okay, <laughs> let's minimize health loss. Okay. There we go. That's a much neater shaft. I don't really have to worry about that stuff at the top right now. Okay, three blocks. Fine. Okay. So now we got uh, a ladder system, a workable one anyway. Whoops, no bollocks. Okay, I'll just fall like that. Boom. Okay, this is... Ah, huh, interesting. I'm back to where... I originally started. Can't quite reach. Yes, I can. Success! Okay. Um, how am I going to get out of there? Let's do this. And then just work backwards. <laughs> it's so messy. But we'll get there. And it's the middle of the night, that's okay. 
Ah, uh, screw it, that block can just be different from its peers. <laughs> and now I got a bunch of weird blocks. I don't care. This is a mine shaft, it doesn't have to be neat. <laughs> so stum. Okay. Bang. Bang. And bang. And now I can actually make this safer. So something's playing in the water out there. Sheepy. Thank you. Okay. Do this. And... Okay, I have glass in here, so this is gonna... Oops, this will form... Something a bit more interesting. I have to go and collect all my resources. Okay. Much better. There we go. That uh, kind of solves everything. Okay, what's this? So it's this one. I'm going to need some more glass. Okay, got three more, so I'll do one, two, three. Oh shit. Spidles, stay away from my house. Okay, so that, that'll that let a natural light. It's a, a very abbreviated version of the X light. You gonna climb on my roof, spider? Yeah, didn't think so. You know what happens to spiders that climb on my roof. Okay. Well, now that everything's been sorted, I can continue my excavations. Down to the limits of eight ladders for the current moment. Or if I run out of pickaxe. And now this just becomes a, a very systematic uh, process where it's just going level by level, clear out all the stone until I hit bedrock. Um, this will actually be a very pointless exercise if I don't come across a cavern and if I don't actually come across any useful minerals. Resources. Why do I always say minerals? Could they technically be classified as minerals? I guess so, but... Yeah. The resources, essentially. In this context. Okay, I need to get a better lighting system as well. better. I want to try and keep this as light as possible. And dawn's breaking. Sweet. And I got plenty of cobblestone, so I'll just finish off this section real quick, and I can go and build some castle, and you can actually look at something a little bit more interesting than a hole in the ground. Now this is essentially, I mean, this is good if you are even remotely interested in my processes, this is my process essentially. If I'm doing a, a mine shaft, I don't usually explore caverns right off the bat. I used to when I first started playing because it's like, oh, it's a pre-made mine, I can just go in and find resources. Um, but this way, I have a much more controlled system and I can build it inside my house and just go uh, do what I want with it. It's good, like, the X-Light's a very good system. Okay, so there's definitely a spider outside. And a creeper. Let's lock and load. And a skeleton. Alright, well, while I'm here, I'm gonna make my box bigger. Oops. Okay, 
now I can store more stuff. I really don't need gravel at the moment. Wool can live there. I need to take some food with me just in case. Okay. So I'm hoping. I wish there was a quick save button on this. Whoa, excessive violence! Okay, there's the spiders. Okay, crap. You come here, you naughty boy. Alright. Clear! Move on to the next checkpoint. I wish. <laughs> so severely lacking in checkpoints, Minecraft. <laughs> One mistake and it's all over. Boom. Okay. I'm really severely tempted in... Whoa, actually, did I lose a shitload of arrows off that? I think I did. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, well, I have flint uh, and stuff to remake them. But the important thing is... I got gunpowder, which I love... Okay, it's time to get building. Not that it's a particularly interesting build just yet. I'm always wondering if this monster's actually in this area. Doesn't look like it. Okay, simple, simple start. You can always clear this stuff out later uh, when it comes to adding windows and such forth. I'm just at this point, I'm. Just want a massive fuck off wall. <laughs> okay. So what space? This is good. I like this technique. This technique seems to work quite well for me. Probably, I mean, as far as I know, it's probably one of the more efficient ways of building. Oh, I'm definitely going to get more, going to need more armor. We will not su sustain these kind of casualties anymore. That's just a useless brick. So that will be replaced. It's a slow, uh, but there's no real other way of doing this. See, it doesn't actually take that long to fill in. 